the, the worst storm in a hundred years. The meteorologists are now saying it's pretty much a done deal. Now, now, that's not the case. They've said that before. It could turn out towards the Atlantic. And, well, if you're fishermen, you better get out of the way. Because we're talking about, you know, 50-foot waves and stuff or, uh, if it goes out to sea. But we're talking about 30-foot waves if it comes in. And it right now is going to just go up the East Coast and will cause a national disaster. There is no doubt this will be declared a national disaster uh, in Maryland, New Jersey, uh, New York, and, and Connecticut and right up that coast. If it, co if it keeps coming in... It it's already... In this is taped a couple of days ago. It's already came in. This is... And another cold this guy right here. Cold fronts from two different angles, the north Alex the Jones, man. This guy's the man. Tornadoes. I love this guy. And they're predicting tornadoes, too, which you're supposed to only have in the spring. Because you got hot, wet air and fast wind. It's raging, Rob. Hurricane I'll post a link to this video below. Okay, I'll post a link to this video below. Well, allegedly, Frankenstorm. Now, what you got is you got Sandy coming in up the east, and you got another front coming in from the west. And you got another front coming in from the north. Three storms all merging into one. And they're calling it the Big Frankenstorm. Now there's a, there's a thing up in Alaska called HARP. Where the government control the, can control the weather. Hold on. <laughs> My lens is dirty. <laughs> okay, hold on. I hate having a dirty lens. So anyway. You got this machine in Alaska. Which can control the weather. Ain't it nice and coincident coincidentally coincidence this happens what a week before the election? Everybody's focused on Romney, focused on Romney. So is it possible that Obama got the harp machine in Alaska working and they created this storm to take everybody's mind off the election? And then Obama wants to make himself look like a hero after the disaster to win votes? Is that a possibility? Being the fact that he faked his birth certificate to get an office. And that, which means he's an illegal immigrant in the country anyway. He's not even supposed to be president anyway. But yeah. That he's a Muslim. He's a Muslim sympathizing terrorist piece of shit is what he is. That shit that happened in Libya. He didn't do a damn thing about it. So this one could be a, this Sandy could be a setup. This could be a made storm. Our government created this storm. Anyway, I'll post the Alex Jones link below. Man, the shit that this guy, the facts he comes up with and stuff. I'll post a link below. And I'll also post the link of the Weather Channel. Uh, live Weather Channel. Channel, yeah, up on, on the link below. You can watch the Weather Channel live. Alright, this is Raging Rob. My Raging Rob... Main channel is suspended right now, so I can't use Firefox. I'm using Google Chrome because I got everything with my Raging Rob channel set up on Firefox. And I can't use YouTube on Firefox, so I'm using Google Chrome right now. My Raging Rob channel is suspended until November 9th because I called somebody an asshole and told somebody to fuck off because he was making fun of handicapped people. So, on Talia Joy 18's channel. So anyway, my account suspended, so you'll see this video on me, probably my Robert Kiss My Ass channel, Rob Hot 192 to the Legacy. So anyway, Frankenstorm, Sandy, check out the links below. I got a girl up in the Boston area I talked to on Facebook. She was affected by it, and there's a couple buddies out in western New York that I talked to. They're affected by the storm. And my dad in Michigan lost power. I don't even know if he has power yet. My brother back in Michigan, they, they said the storm was coming in hundreds of miles in. So it's affecting my relatives back in Michigan. I also got a cousin in North Carolina. I haven't heard from him in a few days. I think he lost power because he hasn't been, hasn't been on Facebook. So cousin down in North Carolina. My brother and dad back in Michigan, my dad lost power. My brother said he didn't lose power, but... I don't know, he had some wind or something up there, so. This is supposed to be the storm of the century. Well, anyway, look at the links below. Frankenstorm, storm of the century. Might be a fake, made-up storm by our government. Check out the links. Peace.